Hey guys, it's Punisher from WalkingDeadArmy.com, and don't revive me, bro, with a Battlefield 4 quick tip. And this week's quick tip is about tap firing. Now, as you can remember in Battlefield 3, you know, for recoil control, you usually had to pull down with your mouse. And when you pulled down with your mouse, after you quit firing, you notice that your reticule would drop down where you were, you know, compensating with your mouse. Well, Battlefield 4, you don't have to do that because when you fire, it's in the same spot. You don't have to do the compensation like you were doing before. So, instead of burst firing to control recoil and to compensate, you can tap fire. And this is how you do it. Alright guys, this is my 240 Bravo LMG I'm using. As you can see here, I'm tap firing. And it's basically you're single firing it, but you're in full auto. Because if I were to hold my mouse button down, well then it would, you know, of course, you know, fire in auto. But what you do is what I do, because I use a claw type grip on my mouse a lot of you know guys use this claw grip and that enables you to quick fire your left uh, mouse button and you know and it won't fire you know multiple bursts instead it'll do this real rapid single fire okay that's what you want to do with this gun as you can see I had a real nice tight pattern when I was tap firing and as you can see now when I'm burst firing to one five four to five round burst you see my pattern is spread out a lot more so this is really what you want to do. And these LMGs, when you're tap firing with these things at medium to long ranges, they are deadly, okay? Up close, you still want to do the full auto, you know, because you'll still be able to hit the guys pretty easy. But when you're at medium long range distances, this tap fire is the way to go. Um, it will brutalize guys as you're getting ready to see. And that's it guys. So get out there and master that tap fire. Use them with those high recoil guns and those and you know, those LMGs, man. The support class with those guns, gosh, it's a beast. So I hope you enjoyed it, guys. If you did like it, please subscribe to the channel. Give me the thumbs up, and you know, share the video. Uh, that's what it's there for. I want to try to help out you know people as much as I can. So anyway, guys, we will see you later, and uh, y'all be good.